Uh, today, we are playing Call of Duty Black Ops 2. In this video, I'm going to teach you my opinion on Snipe. This is a basic tutorial, but on who to snipe. And this is how I've always sniped. So this is how I'm going to teach you guys how to snipe. Alright, first up, we have our class. First thing that's always worked best for me is a blessed with dual with dual bands and full metal jacket along with a DSR with full metal jacket and ACOG sight. Bouncing beddies and shock charges are great for camping. So as a sniper, it's the best thing to do. So we are fighting one bot on veteran mode on Meltdown. Now anybody would tell you that um, Nuketown is the number one 1v1 area. I disagree. I think Meltdown, all in all, is a good map. Let's begin. First of all, you're gonna want this one the best. This one, in my opinion, is the best sniper. First off, he's cheating. That is not supposed to be in your available stuff. You're not supposed to be able to have a crossbow, it's just snipers the way I've set up the game. Okay, so first off, veteran bots cheat. That's something that you need to know. But even when playing with a cheater, the best way to do with them is so that you're better. So, first off, we want to claim an area. Now the fun part begins. Just sit here and collect your shots. Remember to check both sides. Oh, he outsniped, but with a terrible sniper. The sniper he's using, by the way, is one of the worst snipers in the game. And he just paid for it. Like I said, always good to claim an area. Alright, you see that? Really, the sniping is the telling you how to snipe. That's pretty easy. Sniping good yourself is the hard part. I wouldn't recommend hard scoping, but do what you gotta do to get the kill. Next thing I'll show you. This is something I've struggling with and teaching myself. Is drop shot. Seems easy enough, but if you don't do it fast enough, you'll die. Plus, under heavy fire, plus under heavy fire of an automatic weapon, have automatic weapons become the most thing you'll fear as a sniper. Make sure you round in those headshots. Honestly, this is really all I have to teach you in sniping. This is really all you gotta do. Now, you'll probably run across people that'll say, Oh, well, you're just a camper. Campers are bad. You're a horrible sniper. Don't listen to them. Just because you play differently doesn't make you bad. And as you see, he had a flak jacket, which made my weapons useless. But he's also not supposed to have that because it's, that stuff is restricted. Let me see if I have... Oh, well, there he goes. See if I have that stuff restricted. Yeah, everything. That's weird. I normally have flak jacket restricted. Alright. Well, apparently it's not restricted. But, either ways. As long as you have double down that, you should be fine. Just make sure you double down on your, on your stuff.
That's for that one, too. Hopefully, I'll have some music playing in the background. If I don't, then I apologize for the silent for the silence. Just gotta stay focused. As you see, I'm not the best at this stuff, but you know, I'll get better over time. Now you're probably gonna want some of that action. So, if you want some of that action, let me show you. Get in closer. Go for your shot. Really simple as that. If you feel like walking around, go ahead. I wouldn't recommend it because there's a good chance you could die for it. But, especially if an enemy's using a knife, you can easily walk around and feel just fine. Obviously, fighting a real person will be way different because a bot is predictable. If I had a real person that I was better at sniping than, I would show you that play yeah, gameplay. Like but I am not better than most of the snipers I know. The best way to practice your sniping is always use a sn oh, Hold up, guys. Anyways, as I was saying, um, what was I saying? Crap. <laughs> Anyways. Sentry gun ready for deployment. Sentry gun ready for deployment. A sentry gun is a key part of your camping methods. You're going to want to put it in a spot, especially if you know what the bots goes around and does. You're going to want to put it in a spot where you know they'll pass by. Oh, and they traded with me. See, I still have my sentry gun, so since I let since not since I end up spawning there, I'm gonna put my turret right here. We got that stealth chopper up there just watching. We have my score streak set up is Care Package Century Gun AGR. Now, let me see how long this video is going on for. Alright, around 8 minutes. I may shut it down soon, but you guys get the basic idea. Main reason I'll shut it down is because YouTube, unless I verify my account, I'm not allowed to post videos longer than 15 minutes. See? Now he's actually starting to pick up the memo. Alright. So, we see where he likes to take the pipes. So, now we're going to go to where our sentry gun is. And, and move it. If he's not already in the process of destroying it. Be advised, your sentry gun has been destroyed. Yep. Let's see what weapon he was using. This weapon is not allowed. Because he used it. I'm going to use it now. If bots are using a weapon they're not allowed to use, then just feel free to pick up those weapons they're not allowed to use and give them a piece of their own medicine. So let's find this guy and serve him a little bit of his own medicine. Anyways, guys, that'll be the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed. And I hope that your sniping practice goes well. Anyways, this has been Unifier01 teaching you how to snipe. And I will see you guys later.